What is up, everybody? So, in today's video or tonight's video, whenever you're getting this video, I'm gonna be doing a box opening of the new Yu Gi Oh! Dark Saber set. Awesome set, it contains the uh, Brandish Maidens in it, which is why I picked it up because I'm looking for those cards for my stuff. I have regionals on Sunday, and it also contains some vampire stuff, some other stuff. I'm gonna get into that a little bit later. In addition to that, for this video, as a bonus feature for you guys that click the video, I'm gonna be opening five packs of OTS 7. These are packs I've been getting from tournaments. I was actually saving them for a big tournament pack opening, but due to my work schedule, I don't have time to go to tournaments. So with that being said, I figure why not open both? So with all that being said, guys, let's get into it. Without further ado, let's begin. All right, guys, so like I said, this is gonna be a um, double opening of Dark Savers and OTS Pack 7. So yeah, man, so Dark Savers is a set, is a set that's been very high because it includes the Brandish Badens, this little cute right here, girl right here. And they were originally in the Japan, well, in Japan they're called Brandish Maidens, in America they're called Sky Striker. Pretty much the new school Zubiac in the OCG, this deck is pretty much tier one. It gets splashed at everything from decks like Lair of Darkness right here to everything under the sun. I've even seen Brandish Maiden ABC, so yeah. That's gonna be, this is definitely gonna be some, see, something you guys are gonna see consistently in the meta. If you guys haven't seen my video on Brandish Maiden, I did go, you can go to my playlist and go to my um, Brandish Maiden Explain, which I do explain deck in detail. All right guys, so let's open this box up. Let's get the plastic off, so I'm gonna show you what it looks like on the front. Dark Saber, Vampire Vengeance. Five foil cards in every pack, and it is 24 packs per box. Originally when I picked this up today, I paid about 94, well 93 with tax. And I'm like, this feels kind of light. I'm like, oh, it's 24 packs per box. I thought it was 48 packs in a box. I think that's for regular boxes. And I noticed five cards that are the same attempt. Side right here, okay. Back of the Konami. Um, entire set includes 40 super rares, four per pack, and 20 secret rares, one per pack. So you get one secret per pack, which is a pretty good deal. For you guys that like to get all that stuff. Next side right here. Alrighty, let's get into the box. Random girlfriend earring right here. Open it up with that. She don't need this anyway, you know. So go ahead and pull that open. But yeah, man, I'm definitely aiming for brandish Bane. That's like the main thing that I want out of the set. Everything else is good for collectors and people who want to build zombie decks. So let's get into the first pack, guys. Six plus years old. Everyone knows six year olds don't even play Yu-Gi-Oh anymore. Drop the first pack, so let's get right here. All righty, let's see what we get. Big money, big money. Let's go for Brandish Maiden, you guys. And you guys already know I hope my packs went back, so let's do this. First card. Sky Striker, Mecha Shark Cannon. Okay, first card I need. That's good. If you control no monsters in your main monster zones, target one monster in your opponent's graveyard. Banish that monster. Well, if we have three or more spells in your graveyard, you special that monster for your field of set. Definitely needed this for my deck. Thank you for giving it to me. Konami, holla at your boy. Next up. Oops, went too fast. Whoops, Sky Striker Evil Booster, okay. Um, okay, not bad. Don put a marksman for higher, for higher. For higher, I did a video on these. They're supposed to be okay at best. All right, I'm gonna put everything that I don't want over here. Okay, good card. Next up, Vampire Awakening. That's the one vampire from your deck, but not bad, okay. And the first card of the pack. Vampire Orcus. Number three, especially someone that's in the front hand. Not a pet. First pack, pretty good so far. Pretty good, guys. Pretty good. Zoom in right there. Perfect. Second pack. Alrighty, let's see what we get first. Once again, we're gonna do it from the back first. So I guess it's gonna be the back. The last card is the secret rares. Come on, Sky Striker. Training, uh, some fur higher thing. Let me read some read it, it's a secret rare. If a face-up monster for how you control the show by battle, right point card effect, you can target one of those for monsters for summon from your deck. Yeah, good for the deck if you're building it, but overall it's not something I wanted, but beggars can be killed. So we got, what, 22 more packs left? Let's get into it. All right, another Sky Striker card. This is the card that makes a token. Definitely need, this, need that for the Sky Striker deck. Next up, hey, I got a rain. Perfect. Not playing it at all. So let's see, Fandor the Flying Fortress. This is another Fur Hire car. I'll read over that in a second. I might build a Fur Hire deck. The car, archetype seems pretty interesting. And Vampire Rage. So, so far I got out of two packs, this must brand is made and stuff. 
it appears that they're not short printed, which is awesome. So I'm not complaining at all. Alrighty, next pack, open it up. Let's see what I pick, see what I get. That card first, come on, big money, big money, big money. Vampire's Domain. Okay, another vampire card I do not want, but let's read it. Once per turn, you pay 500 life points. During your main phase, this is one. Yeah, <laughs> not, it's not something that I want, but it is what it is. Definitely need another Raider. Come on, good Raider. Okay, okay, Mecca, pretty good. Mm -hmm. Another Fur Hire card, okay. Shadow Vampire, okay. Good for zombie players. Tomb Table Contents, definitely good for the um, Skyshaker deck. So, so far, pulled one Ray. Mecha Drones. Let's see what else I get. Back card first. Fur Hire. Okay. Not even gonna read them. I'm just gonna get through this and I don't wanna make the video too long. Mirror Force. Not bad of a card. Okay. Horn of Adam Beast. Okay. Not bad. Vampire Red Baron. Not bad at all. Okay. And Plague Spreader. That's actually a pretty good card. Plague Spreader is pretty solid. Alrighty. About five minutes in. If you guys haven't liked the video already, like the video, support the channel. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and show your boys some support. Alrighty. Back card first. Magical Citadel of Endymion. All right, I didn't know that was a reprint there, but I remember this was a starter deck card, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see, next up. Reckon for hires, okay. Started out good with the um, Brandish Maiden stuff, now it's starting to slow down my luck. I'm not liking that. Shizuki, definitely needed that, okay. Back in the game, baby. All right, let's see what's going on. Next up pack. Let's see. Another fur hire. We don't want these. We want brandish made. Come on, guys. Come on, Ray. Another fur hire. Okay. Monarch Storm Fork. Good reprint as a foil. Not bad. Even though we already had it. Quick booster. Okay. Something that we're not going to use. Dark Reffer. Another good reprint, but something we're not going to use for the set. Alrighty. Next up. Next pack. Alrighty. So far. So far. I mean, I can't complain. So far, we did pick some, get some decent brandish made and stuff. It's not everything we wanted. Let's see what's going on next. Uh, Brandon Maiden. Sky Striker, yes. Another Sky Striker card, which is what I needed. Like my son says, this is what I always wanted. You know, kids always say that. Be sure no monster can make monster cards on. Target one set, but I try to strip. Yes, definitely need that, so. Not complaining at all. Let's see, next up. Sky Striker. I know the deck definitely plays one of the, um, this is a field spell, right? It plays one of those, so I'm not complaining. Yep. Scapegoat. Why not? I, I was actually looking for a scapegoat. Another Ray. And another Fur Hire. Okay, so far this seems like a good value. I mean, for a tier one deck to be in one box, not complaining. I debated on buying two boxes, but one box seems like be everything I need. I got trade bait, and then not to mention two, I can just buy everything else singly. So the Brandish Maiden stuff may be cheaper. Now, I haven't checked prices. You guys can tell me about prices in the comment section down below. Vampire, okay. Not complaining, Vampire, part of the set, Kareem Bandit. All right, definitely didn't need that, but I'll take it. Full of barrel goods. Okay, reprint, good for Spiral players, if you guys play Spirals. Vampire Vamp, Lord Darkness. Gills and Branch made in the spoil, not complaining. All righty, next up. Come on. It's actually pretty exciting opening these packs. I can't, I can't see why people would watch packs over this time. It's actually pretty fun doing. Oh, another vampire. Okay. Back over here. Mwahaha. Let's see. Next up. Flex Pro. Okay. Not bad. Armageddon Knight. Not bad. Some good foil reprint. Dark Reffer. Okay. At least I got the old cards if I ever needed for heroes. And Vampire Returner. I can play Dark Heroes now without picking the first up. Alrighty. Once again, if you guys not, have not hit that subscribe button, subscribe for more Yu-Gi-Oh! content and or smash that like button. Let's try to get this video up to 200 likes to get promoted in that new YouTube algorithm. Also, if you guys haven't seen my video today about the YouTube algorithm, you can check that out. Oh my God, I got another good card. Once per turn, you can target one card that controls and that card is the graveyard. Also, you're trying to connect to the card respond to this card. You can set one sky You know what? I don't feel like reading it. I just know it's good and I needed it for my day. Not complaining at all. Just Mystic Tomato, pretty good card. Alrighty, so yeah, Mystic Tomato, pretty good card. Not complaining at all. Let's see, I don't think I need it for Brandish Maiden because Ray is a 1600 beater, 1500. So you can probably, nah, I don't know if I need her. Nah, you don't play her, you don't play, you don't play Mystic Tomato. Rota's good, Foil Rota's not bad. Sky Striker, another Sky Striker card, okay. 
and Kagari. Wow. I thought they were, I thought these were secret. Wow. So I got one Kagari and I got one Shizuki. Not complaining. Hey, I thought those were gonna be more harder to pull, but I guess not. Perfectly fine with that. So far, I got a quarter of the deck I need, if not all of it. Let's see what the next pack's gonna un unfold for me. Another um, fur hire card. Alrighty. Let's see, next up. Brutal is at three only if, right? Crimson Knight Vampire. More generic vampire stuff. I mean, it is what it is. Fur hire, okay, and quick booster. Alrighty. Let's see. Still got a bunch of packs left to open up. See you guys, let's see. Next up, Vampire Domination. Did not need that Dominatrix card. Flying Fortress for Fur Hire, okay. Drowning Mirror Force, actually a pretty good reprint. I'm gonna put that over there because I like that card a lot. And more stuff, okay. Try to speed through this because I don't want the video to be too, too long. Okay, let me keep trying to angle my camera pretty better. There we go, I think that's better. All right, perfect. All right, now let's try to see what we got. Another vampire card. Hey, it's a, it's a cover card. I'll read them later. I don't. What does it do? Two plus level six monsters. Use the monster level six on back on X Y Z. Just have some materials. Target one card from control. Something to the graveyard. Once per turn. Yeah, pretty good effect, but I don't need them. I don't know what he's going for. You guys can post that in the comment section down below. Okay, that pretty is pretty good. Target one face of spark. Yeah, well, okay, that's. Adding spell counters not that good. And vampires. Okay. I'm gonna open up the rest of this from the pack from the box right there. So we got a bunch of packs left. We're gonna open up these OTS7. I'm gonna flat those OTS7s real fast. Let's see what's going on. Let me try to angle this camera, fix it a little bit. Make it nice and square. Alright, that's better. Perfect. Okay. Probably should be fixing camera angles during the video, but whatever it is, what it is. Let's see. Alrighty, so let's see. Fur hire. What a surprise, not a fur hire. Three banded, okay. Come on, right. I need another right, baby. I need another right, baby. I need another right. Ah, oh, another Sky Striker card, okay. So let's see. I believe I need play sets of the um of these guys. I got one of each, the of the link monster, so that's not bad. I might play just a smaller angel for regional if I can't get everything. We're, we're gonna see what's gonna happen when I get that though. Okay, another Sky Striker card, okay, not bad. Secret is a start. Another Sky Striker, okay, can I get a ray? Got a fur hire, can I get a ray? Got a vampire, can I get a, oh, tomb table. Hey, not complaining, tomb table. Okay, it is what it is. You got that tomb table. One more makes the play set that you need for the deck. All righty, let's see. Next up, Magical Citadel of Endymion. Don't need that. Kagiri, yes. Come on, right. For higher, uh. Sky Striker Eagle Booster. I definitely need that for sure. Another Sky Striker card, okay. Perfect. So far, so good with Sky Striker stuff, not gonna um, lie. Let's see, next up. Next up, come on, too strong, too strong. Sky Striker Ambush, you control no monsters, your main target, one face up and destroy it. Yeah, we need that, we need all that, yup. Mm-hmm. Next up, come on, I need one more ray to make my playset though. I don't want to buy another pack, so pox. And a Shizuki, yes, perfect. I almost got a playset of those. If this box, if ever, so far this box ain't lit, not gonna lie, great value. Um, definitely pick up a pack, a box, at least one box to open for fun if you're looking to play the Branch Maidens. And if you're looking for no hassle to like trade with people, like, I always advocate for people just to trade, per se. And, okay, this is pretty good too. Because it is cheaper and buying singles, but if you just want no hassle and have some fun, open up a box. Save you some money sometimes, save you the hassle and the headache. Another vampire card. Not what we need, but it's not what we're gonna get. Another scapegoat, not bad. Yes, another raid. Perfect. Almost done with my, I got maybe like four, four packs there, five packs there? Okay, cool. I think I actually built it. I think I got the core out of one box. This is insane. I'm gonna check out the video. It's over to see if I got the core or not. Vampire's Desire, okay. Plague Spreader, okay. Oh no, that's not a flying. Yeah, that's for Fur Hire, okay. Vampire Awakening and Grimson, okay. Favorite box. 
Okay, almost 15 minutes in. Um, if you guys haven't liked the video already, like and support the channel. Smash that like button. Oh, wrong way. Hold on. Training for fur hire. We don't need that at the moment, but I'll take this for Seeker Rare. Plague Spreader, okay. Armageddon Knight. And Vampire, okay. Perfect. Almost done with the pack. All right, let's see what we get. Okay, another shark cannon. Pretty good. All righty. Okay, don't need that. Don't need that. And don't need that. And I don't want you guys to pretend like, don't toss the cards like that. And stuff not nice. We are trying to make sure we get the stuff we need for this tournament on Sunday. Another vampire card. Don't need that one, but it's not bad. Don't need that either. Next. Come on, Ray. Nope. Nope. Quick booster. Okay. Last pack. Well, I don't need Ray anymore. I just need more, like, stuff, support. Maybe Kagiri, if I possibly can, but I ain't complain. For higher. Koala. Orcus. Hey, Shizuki can't. I, I take it. Alrighty, so the Dark Savers portion of the video is over. Uh, let's see what I got. I got about out of one box for days. I got that. I need another tune table. I can pick it up at regionals. And let's see. Got a place out of Shizuki. Hey, this is almost pretty much what I need. Um, so yeah, the ratio seem to be pretty solid. I got a place out of Rays in one box, which is awesome. I don't have to worry about picking that stuff. I think I pretty much got the entire core, give or take a few cards for 93 bucks, which is not a bad. I mean, if these cards are short printed, this is a good value. If not, it may be a bad value, but I'll go over that in a, in a later video. But yeah, man, this is, this is, this is lit. We, we live for regions. All right, next up, last part of the video. Try to make the part super, super fast. Go with this video going on 20 minutes and I don't want to make it 20 minutes. All right. OCS Pack 7, my tournament winning from like a month and a half ago. Let's see. First card. Magical Library. Vampire World. Oh, I'm sorry. Zombie World. Prickly Fair. Not bad. Okay. Next up. Power through these. The Power Round. Let's see. Pop on. Come on, Alti. 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 This pack is giving me a hard time. This pack is giving me the hard time. Okay, here we go. Oh, um, nope, fossil dig. And okay. Next up. Let's see what we get. One, nope. Don't need that. Pulled enough of these out of the um, box. And it's, why did they reprint it so many times? It's crazy. All righty. Ugh. Ugh. Last pack, five OCS packs, no ultimates, this sucks. Oh well, but I'm still happy that I got that branch right and stuff. That saves me a headache for people who don't have time to trade and who don't have time to, have time to buy singles. One box definitely did its justice. Two boxes would probably put the nail on the coffin. I'm gonna reveal all these. Alrighty, so this is my ultimate extravaganza opening. I pulled a majority of the branch made and stuff, give or take a few cards. I probably need a play set of this and a playset of some of the spells and traps that comes in due time. Post your thoughts and opinions about the stuff you guys think I need in the comment section down below if you guys play Brandon's Maiden. Subscribe if you haven't. I gotta get this video open. I'm heading to the gym right now. This is Innovation YGO and I'm signing out. Peace and stay innovative, guys. Deuces.